Hello everyone! In today's video I'm going to explain how to set up a Noia node on Windows. The first thing you need is Docker, an application that is used to run software containers. We will need it to run our Noia node. You can download Docker from its official webpage, which is docs.docker.com. Then you can go to download and install and go to Docker desktop for Windows and download it and install it just like you do with any other app. Once you have it installed, you need to go to your router, connect to it and open one port. You can do it by opening your explorer and writing the IP of your router, which is usually 192.168.0.1. Click enter and you probably will have to put your username and password. If you don't have them, ask your ISP for them. Depending on your router's brand, this step might vary, but essentially what you need to do is to find a tab where you can open ports. It's usually called port forward table, like you're seeing on the screen. You're gonna have to add one entry in that table and open the port 9835. It's the type UDP. And here you need to write the IP of the computer in which you will be running your Noia node. If you don't know your computer's IP, you can get it by opening the command prompt of Windows. And inside it, you can write the command ipconfig and hit enter. It will show you all the IPs of your network. Once you have added that entry on the table, click on save. And that's it, your port is open. Once your port is open and Docker is installed and open, in which case you should see something like this, there's no containers running yet, you need to open the command prompt on, on Windows, if you haven't already, and there write this command. This command alone will download the necessary files and get your Noia node up and running. Once you have run that command, if you go to the Docker app, you will see that something changed. You now have this Docker container up and running. And you can click here where it says open in browser. This will open a new tab on your browser showing all the current connections of all the current running Noia nodes. And that's it, your node is up and running. 